this channel has made a total of in this video i'm going to be sharing how i made my first 100 dollars online and i'm going to be fully transparent with all that happened on the journey to my first 100 dollars online so if you like that be sure to subscribe to the channel and smash that notification icon so you can be informed anytime i drop new interesting videos like this if you're new here this channel is all about wealth business and everything making money online so definitely smash that subscribe button and the notification bell so that anytime i drop new interesting videos like this you'll be the first to be notified I'm going to be fully transparent, I'm not going to hide anything, I'm going to take you to the back end of this YouTube channel and you see exactly how much this channel has made so far so good. Also smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm, it definitely helps this channel grow and it allows this video to get seen by a larger audience. Now the aim of this video is not to brag, definitely there's nothing to brag about, this channel is still a very small channel. The aim of this video is just to inspire those of you that want to start a YouTube channel to go ahead and start a YouTube channel because there's no better time to start a YouTube channel than in 2021. So this channel was started sometime March 2020, about 10 months ago. Now if I scroll down here, you will see the very first video was uploaded 10 months ago. And so far the channel has uploaded about 66 to 70 videos almost 70 videos so far so good this channel got monetized sometime september 2020 since then let me go to the back office of the channel real quick then in the entire lifetime of the channel so there you can see this channel has made a total of 218 dollars 45 cents since monetization now the thing with youtube is you definitely have to be consistent with youtube if you stop posting videos on youtube YouTube will stop recommending your content and then your channel tends to begin to die. So as you can see, this is May 25th, 2020 and there was a steady growth on the channel until we got to this area. Now what happened here was I was preparing for a professional examination that's going to help me advance my career. So I began posting a lot less. In fact, at a point I was only posting about one video in two weeks. So the channel began to die steadily starting from this point. When I saw the channel was dying, I began posting like one video a week and it grew again. When the exam came and I had no other option than to abandon everything and face the exam, the channel began to die. So that's the little thing with YouTube. If you are not consistent, your channel is going to die. So if you are starting a YouTube channel, you need to put it at the back of your mind that you really can never stop except you want your channel to die anyway. So after the exam, I started becoming a little bit more consistent with the posting and that's how you are seeing the growth coming back to the channel. So if you want to start a YouTube channel, you don't have to show your face. If you want to show your face, that's fine. You just need an average camera. It doesn't have to be a very good camera. An average camera can do the job for you. And then you have to make content around topics that you are comfortable talking about or topics that you are knowledgeable in. That's all you need and then you are good to go then post at least two to three videos per week and in about a year or two years i guarantee you youtube can be a very very substantial source of income by far the most important thing on youtube is consistency and i'll give you an example of two youtubers now i picked these two channels for a very good reason this is gram stefan's channel with 2.81 million subscribers and then this is meet kevin's channel with just a little over 1 million subscribers now anybody looking at graham's channel would feel graham has 2.8 million subscribers so definitely he should be making more money on youtube than meet kevin who has only a little over 1 million subscribers wrong graham here only uploads mondays wednesdays and fridays so about 10 videos a month as you can see so he had 13 million views this month but meet kevin who has a lot less number of subscribers was able to upload an outstanding 135 videos this month and had 36 million views. So Meet Kevin is likely making more money on YouTube than Gram Stephen, even though Gram Stephen has more subscribers. So the idea is the subscriber base you have isn't what is really important. What's important is how consistently you upload and how engaging your videos are. Those are the two most important metrics. However, that is not to say that you shouldn't smash the subscribe button if you haven't already. If you guys have questions about creating a YouTube channel or making videos on YouTube or any kind of YouTube related question, be sure to drop them in the comment section below and I'll reply to them as soon as I see them. I would love to read your comments. Well, that's all for this video. This video was a very short one. Let me know your thoughts about this in the comment section below and I'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers.